Well, let's get in the mood now. There's the glitter ball, and we're all hoping to raise a lot of money tomorrow night. We've all been training hard, haven't we, we Derek? Have. You're aching too. Tell me about it, Lucia. <laughs> My knee's still clicking. I've been walking around the building like John Wayne. He, he really has. He really has. Well, yesterday we had our first group rehearsal and our first look. Very impressive they were, yes. too. Be afraid, you two. We are. Trust Mind me. you, I'm not sure about Jamie. I reckon he needs a lot more work and practice. See what you think. Have a look. The first thing you'll notice about the latest rehearsals is that we all need a lot more. But this was a chance to find out just how good the opposition are, and the verdict, they're very good. First up for Radio Wales, Jamie and Louise, elegant and strong, and some of Jamie's moves quite staggering. Get off! Next! No, oh, we're going out there to win, aren't we? We're very competitive. Yeah. We are going out to win. Definitely. We want to win. Yes, yeah, we'll definitely. give it our best shot. Whatever it takes. For sure. Even if it means nobbling the opposition. Shh. As for Lucy and Rodri, who are representing X-Ray, seamless and so fast. Up, down, some of their moves straight off the Strictly dance floor. My hope is that we just don't fall off the stage. That's yes. my hope. Yeah, and it's not about the winning, is it? No, it's, it's about, about the, the taking, taking part. part. Now, Derek and I, well, it's been a bit of a struggle, but so much fun. His John Sargent moment usually works, but catching me at the end, well, that's a different matter. I cannot believe that. I thought we were going to have a nightmare. We did. <laughs> We've seen a lot of Jamie's belly this afternoon, I tell you. <laughs> we kind of watched each other do the individual performance. Lucy and Rodri are really good. They're lifting, they're spinning. Jamie and Louise They've have got some, a few good moves, they got haven't some they? fabulous moves. We'll be fine as long as we can get through it without forgetting it, without tripping up, without oh, dropping If she doesn't me, step or... on my big toe, do you fancy going on Strictly Come Dancing one day? Do you think we've got what it takes? We've had lots of support for Team Wales today and you won't believe who's backing us. Well, I've heard about Claire and Derek. I think Derek's legs look amazing in those pink leggings. You know, he's causing a fashion stir. Claire, you've got a lot of work to do with him now, love. Uh, but good luck with it. And you never know, Strictly, you may get there next year. Claire and Derek, I've heard you putting on your dancing shoes. Um, all the very best to you. It's for a great cause, children in need. Um, but I've heard that you're pretty useless, so perhaps you'll need all that luck. Uh, go for it. Claire and Derek, boa sorte. It means good luck for you. Thanks. Our dance teachers are certainly nervous. Their reputations are on the line, and tomorrow night is fast approaching. This evening, we have a full dress rehearsal and a last chance to put things right. It just, it, it just needs a little fine tuning, it will be there. <laughs> It needs a lot more than that. But as you can see, Derek was hot and sweaty there. It's hard work, but you always come um, dressed for the part. Well, I thought I'd swap the pink leg warmers for these blue ones. <laughs> I'm not sure you meant to wear them like that, Lou. He just loves wearing those <laughs> leg warmers, doesn't he? But can I just say, I cannot believe that you two have been drumming up celebrity support behind we my have. back. Can you believe it? We've been busy today as well with paper and scissors. We have, Look yeah. what we made. We don't, we don't mean to rub, oh. your, rub your nose in it, Lucy, but there's one for Claire <laughs> oh. and one for me. We thought you might like Rubbish. One. Do you think those are impressive? Just you wait till you see what Team X-Ray supporters have come up <laughs> with tomorrow night. These are nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be great fun, is it? We're all looking forward to it. And for children in e needs, of course. But there's certainly nothing to laugh about uh, or smile about as far as the weather is concerned, of course. It's all downhill again tonight. More heavy rain spreading across Wales. In fact, the Met Office has issued another weather warning. The heavy rain accompanied by strong to severe gale force winds. Now, I can tell you that uh, in the last 48 hours, over 120 millimetres of rain has fallen near Capel Kirig in Snowdonia. That's five inches of rain. So there is a real risk of more flooding. By the way, a few tickets are still available available for the BBC Children in the concert at the Wales Millennium Centre tomorrow night. Details on the BBC Wales website. Lucy. I can't take you seriously in those leg warmers. Derek, thank you very much again.